So in this video, we're going to create our listing in our Etsy shop for the printful item that we created. Hey everybody, my name is Margaret. Welcome to my channel, Texas Gal Treasures. I'm creating a playlist of videos on how to create sublimation print for whether you're using this for printful or something else, but I made a really cool dress using the sublimation print and um, it's up on printful. So in this series of videos, I'm going to have everything from setting up your printful account to how to integrate it with Etsy and also different ways to create a sublimation print because there are a few different ways and there might be different um, things you're trying to create. And so I'm going to be creating each in its own separate video. So if you're interested in checking those out, make sure to check out the playlist and to save it to your watch later or whatever print on demand um, playlist that you may have saved so that you can find it when you need it. And I hope you enjoy. Uh, leave me a comment and let me know uh, what you think of everything. Make sure when you go to sign up for Printful and Etsy that you use my links down below that uh, lets Printful know that I'm the one that sent you. And also on Etsy, it gives you 40 free listings. So uh, make sure you use those down below. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much. So once you have your dress or your item and it is done loading, it'll say edit in Etsy. You can either click that or you can go straight to your Etsy shop. It will be in your draft listing. So if you come in, it'll be in draft mode. Um, let me see if it'll go back to show you. It's not, it doesn't go straight to live. So one draft item, that's where it is. Skater dress. So then you fill in your title. You get quite a few um, characters. I'm going to try to describe it the best I can. And you could go in and add more info and all that stuff. Um, they have the measurements already in there for you. Now, about the listing. Who created it? Yes, you created the design, but another company or person is going to be printing it. So you need to select that. What is it? It is a finished product. It is made to order. It is a dress. Sizes, I offer more than one, so leave that. Primary color is, I guess, blue because that's my background. Dress style, um, we are going to select skater and circle. Clothing style, you don't have to select anything there. Choose pattern. Mm, I don't know what to say for my hamburgers and hot dogs. Neckline is kind of like a scoop pattern. I'm wearing a scoop neckline. Um, silhouette. Uh, no pocket, sleeve length, it is sleeveless. Um, and then da, 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 I want to automatically relist. And then here you can, you know, create a better description if you want. Sometimes I'll copy the title and put it in here. And you can add more, you know, check out my other items and blah, 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 blah. Now, you have to add a production partner for Printful. Production partner is Printful, and they have got um, California office about, this is a print on demand um, printer, basically. And then why am I working with them? I don't have the technical ability or equipment to make this entirely by myself. What's my role in this? Let's see, I design it, and then I get the technical help, pattern making, blah, blah, blah. What is Printful? They make a component, I do the rest. They create the finished product that I alter. Basically, they do everything. <laughs> so now I can choose to let my buyer see this or not. So I can, so that's that. So I'll select Printful. And then down here is where I would add you know, like hamburger dress. These are tags for search engine. So you can add up to 13. So add as many as fits your purpose. Materials is optional. Um, down here, I just leave everything as is because Printful fills that in. I leave the this selected as is because Printful fills that in as well. And then that's pretty much it. And I select Publish. Publish. It says it's using up one of my free ones. Free. So it shows I've got one active item. Here it is and I can view it. And then we'll come back in later and I'll show you how to make your dress, I mean, I'll show you how to make your shop um, look good with a banner and a description and all that fun stuff. So here, you know, it's pretty empty. If somebody came in and saw this, they would probably not want to buy my dress because there's no image there. There's nothing about me, you know, none of my terms of service and things like that. 
Don't forget, you guys, I've got two links down below. One is for signing up for Printful, and the other one is to get your 40 free listings for Etsy. Thanks for checking out the video, everybody. Go down there and leave it a thumbs up, and leave me a comment and let me know what you thought. Was it clear? Did you understand? Or was there something I need to elaborate on? I really appreciate you coming to check it out, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.